This coffee brewing method has been evolving for years and now it's one of the biggest trends for filter coffee. It started with the clever dripper, which introduced this concept of having an open and closed valve at the bottom. The valve stays closed while the clever dripper is set on a flat surface. So you brew your coffee like this and then the valve opens when it's set on top of a cup or carafe and it lets all of the coffee drain out. After this came the Hario switch, which uses a little steel ball to plug a hole at the bottom of the dripper. The ball sits like this while the coffee brews, blocking any of the coffee from being able to drain out. When it's done brewing, you press the switch, which dislodges the steel ball and creates a route for the coffee to drain. After this came the next level Pulsar, which is a no bypass brewer with a valve in its base that you can open or close using the lever like this. And most recently came this bottomless dripper from S-Works Design, which uses a needle valve that you turn this way to open and this way to close the valve. If you see it going too fast, you can turn it clockwise like this to slow the flow rate down. And if you need to speed it up, you can turn it counterclockwise like this to make it go faster.